Hey everybody, Captain Spidey Fist here. I'm going to be unboxing this Marvel Shocker uh, from that, the Spider-Man Legends series. So, the reason that I wanted to get this character is I'm trying to get more villains. I have mostly just uh, just superheroes, and I wanted to, you know, e expand the repertoire a little bit. So I picked up Shocker. Uh, Herman Schultz suits up in battle armor that produces intense shockwaves, earning him the notorious name Shocker. The Shocker, I shock people. So... Uh, you see on the back, it, it does come with uh, Sandman's leg here, and it shows a couple of the characters. Uh, I'm probably going to have to get a hold of that, that Britain Spider-Man right here. So let's go ahead and open it up. Alright. Sandman's leg here. It's bendy. Alright, so here is what I think is just super cool, is these uh, these special effects, super effects pieces. Uh, I really loved Dazzler's uh, little little hand blast, so I mean, that that's so cool. Alright, it might be a little loud. Okay, so he's got another one for this hand. Uh, his hand moves forward and back just a little bit, not too much, but you do have the full rotation. You've got the double pivot for the arm. You got upper bicep rotation, full rotation of the shoulder, high low. Not bad. It doesn't come up as high as I would like it to uh, for the rotation here, but I, I guess that's pretty natural. Uh, you do have that that bend has that little click. You got his head here. Uh, goes back a, a pretty good distance as far as you know, like Marvel Legends figures go. That's pretty pretty far back. This comes forward. Uh, you have the full rotation here. Thigh rotation. Calf rotation. You have the uh, the double bend. And it's pretty cool. They actually have this, this kneecap on top of that, you know, the little piece that actually rotates and bends. So that's, that's pretty neat. I like how that looks. But again, we, you know, you get to the boots and the boots have like, I mean, they have a little bit of detail on them. But nothing really to write home about. You got a little heel there. You do have the little hex hole on the bottom for putting them on stands. You have the, the hole in the back for the uh, the figure stands that, you know, plug in from the back so you can get some cool jumping shots without having him wrapped up and stuff. Not not a bad figure. Uh, I, I like him. He, he's pretty good. And then his little effects here. Let's probably go that way. Hook onto his hands. You can do his, his his shocker blasts here. This one seems a little bit looser. This one has it looks like it has a, a tighter U on it. But with finagling, you can make it look awesome. Pretty good figure, all in all. I like his little uh, his little lightning bolt here. And as far as the you know the I guess fence design that goes down these diamonds on him, I mean it looks good. The figure has very very good color. Uh, however, I mean you can see the brown holes here. That always drives me nuts, but I mean, I, I imagine that it would, it, it's not bad, it's not bad, because they, they match out on the front, on the outside. All in all, very good figure, very happy with it. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. I'm Captain Spidey Fist, and I'm out of here.